Okay, so you just hosted a webinar or a podcast and it went great. Now it's time for the hard part, repurposing your hour long video clip into even more content. If you work at a large enterprise company, you might put in a request with the video team, but they're swamped. So instead of waiting weeks for the video team to get to it, you just use Capsule. Capsule helps teams create more short form videos all while staying completely on brand. They work directly with brand teams to build out a motion design system that everyone can use. Think of it like a library of pre-approved templates that allow everyone in your company to create videos that look and feel on brand. Let's go ahead and dive into an example, but before that, my name's Rena. I've been editing videos for 10 years and I'm excited to show you guys the fastest way to repurpose your content. For this example, we're going to use this awesome design system the Apollo team created to edit our webinar. First, let's go ahead and upload our video to Capsule and allow Capsule to transcribe our clip. Instead of having to listen back to your video a hundred times to find the best clips, you can just search the transcript to find the parts of the video that you want to use. I remember this one part of the webinar where Travis Tyler talked about having source materials to generate video ideas. So I'm going to click Command F on my keyboard to bring up the search function. And I can enter the keywords I remember. I'm going to just start with source. Now I can scroll down and see all of the conversations around that keyword. I really like this one part, so I'm going to highlight all of the text and hit create so that a clip gets created for me. Now that I have my clip, I want to cut out all of the pauses. When we use short form clips, we're typically targeting an audience on social media that's mindlessly scrolling. That's why I want to cut out as much of the silence as I can. Normally this would take me hours, but with Capsule, I can ask AI to take out all of those silences for me. So I'm going to drag this somewhere between balanced and energetic. After a second, all of those highlighted boxes disappear and my silences are gone. Another way to keep attention is by zooming into your speaker, also called cutting in. So here, I'm going to find a couple spots where I think we should cut in to emphasize points. I really like this quote. What are most like viewed blog pages? Which is getting the most traffic? Which is getting the most conversion? So I just split the clip where I want the cut in to happen and I drag up the scale by selecting crop. I can adjust the position too to make sure that my eyes stay in the same spot to help with viewer eye contact. And now for probably one of the most important parts of short form clips, captions. Since Capsule already completed my transcription, I just have to highlight all of my text and select captions. If I were on the Apollo team, I'd know that these captions are already good to go because they were built and approved by my brand team. And now if you want to get even fancier, you can add in a few extra graphics. And I think I'm just about done, but I know that other teams are going to need this clip to use on YouTube, LinkedIn, and in a newsletter. So all I do is select those platforms and my video will automatically resize for those formats. Then I hit share and I send the link to the social and demand gen teams for them to review and download the video. One of the easiest hacks is to have really good source material. It takes a lot of the pressure and the onus off of you as the creator to do it all. I started doing that at PandaDoc a few years ago by just going into Google Analytics, asking my team for access to it, and then saying like, all right, what are our most like viewed blog pages? Which is getting the most traffic? Which is getting the most conversion? And then saying like, okay, I'm gonna convert this into a video. And it's not the world's funniest, sexiest, most creative video. Well, holy crap, is it a high performing video? Because if it's doing well on one search engine, it's gonna do well on another search engine. And that's it. Cutting down webinars in Capsule is super easy. You can edit and export your first three videos in Capsule for free. Try it out at capsule.video.